Good afternoon from Budapest on day four of the World Dog Show. Um, apologies for the noise, but we're sitting next to the main ring and there's a demonstration of a horse at the moment. Um, as an Englishman, I'm very proud to have sitting next to me today the chairman of the Kennel Club, uh, the English Kennel Club, but the Kennel Club, uh, Steve Dean, if you'd like to just tell people. Well, thanks, Mike. Yes, I'm Steve Dean. I'm chairman of the Kennel Club. I'm a veterinary surgeon. Yep. The first one who's been chairman of the Kennel Club. 14th chairman. Right. It's a really exciting job. Yep. And it's really good fun. Good. And, and not only a vet and chairman of the Kennel Club, but a dog person as well? Oh, indeed. I breed Border Terriers, shown Border Terriers for the best part of 30 years, mm. um, with some success. Good. So and it, judge as well, all over the I world. I judge Borders. I judged here on Thursday, Border Terriers. Yeah. I've really enjoyed that. Good. And here we are in Budapest, and I think the weather's slightly better than it is back I've, in England. I've got to tell you, it's been lovely having a few days here in the <laughs> yeah. warmth. I'm wearing a light suit, yeah, exactly. this is fantastic. And I've, I just got a, a photo back from SKC and it is absolutely yeah. thrown it down. But um, the impressions of the World Dog Show? I very much enjoyed it. It's been uh, really very well organised by the Hungarians. They've done a good job. It can't be easy organising a show like this once uh, you know, on an on occasion. Yeah. Uh, so to take this around the world, each time it must be a fresh challenge. But uh, what I've seen here has been great. The dogs have been wonderful. The people have been very friendly. We've been looked after very well by the Hungarians. This is a, a great event. Good chance to meet people. I mean, I've met lots of old friends as far away as Australia, but I've also met some new friends, and that's one of the big advantages of this type of thing. Totally, totally agree. And obviously, from an English point of view, we have a slightly well-known dog show ourselves, which is probably the best-known dog show in the world, which is Crofts, and obviously you're a key member of, of, of making Crofts happen, so you've got a good idea of how much work goes into these events. Indeed. I, I think it's a little unfair comparing this to Crofts. We do Crofts every year. Yeah. We have a, a team full-time organising Crofts. Someone said to me, uh, when do they start organising Crofts next year? And I said, well, we've already started organising <laughs> the next Crofts. And indeed, we're choosing the judges for three or four crofts in advance. Yeah. So it's a little unfair because to compare them, because we really are, are, we like to believe we're professionals at this yeah. job. And crofts is, after all, it, it's a real family affair. We, yeah. we put it on as a family dog show. Yeah. And it shows every aspect of the dog yeah, in exactly. human life. Yeah. Whereas here, with, with, it, it's just a different scale. Yeah. And, and I, I don't think you should try and no. compare them. Good. Uh, thanks very much. Let's hope we have a great last eight hours of the show. I'm looking forward to tonight. It should be great. Yeah, thank you very much. You're indeed. welcome, Mike.